Hi there, Gary here from Longsons. I'm going to take you on a brief video tour of this really well presented, uh, deceptively spacious, semi-detached, extended house we have available, uh, conveniently situated close to the town centre of Watton in Norfolk. Okay, so uh, there's the property right there in front of you. Uh, we've got, as you can see, front garden laid to low maintenance shingle, uh, providing off-road parking. And we've got outside lights, gated access to the rear garden. So uh, I'll just show you the property location. Uh, we're on West Road, which is uh, very close to local schools and not too far at all from the town centre as well. And it's a cul-de-sac, as you can see, location. So uh, very little passing traffic as well. Well, uh, without further ado, let's go and head indoors and have a look around. So we're straight into the entrance hall. We've got stairs up to the first floor. And then uh, just off to our left, we've got um, a current owner's call a boot room. Could quite easily be a, a small study if needed. And window to the front. So if we head to our left, uh, we have got a really good sized kitchen stroke breakfast room. I'll show you that properly in a second. First of all, we'll turn left again and have a look in the lounge. So good size lounge with UPVC French doors opening out to the rear garden. I'll show you the uh, rear garden in full in a very short while, just towards the end of the video. Meanwhile, back to the kitchen stroke breakfast room. So really good size. We've got uh, built-in cupboard, got fitted kitchen units, wall and floor. There's integrated fridge stroke freezer, stainless steel one and a half bowl sink unit, integrated electric hob, integrated double electric oven, extract hood over the hob. There's another built-in cupboard there as well. Tiles to the floor. And then we also have a door through to, uh, we call this the garden room. It's got a solid roof with a Velux window, so we're not going to get too hot in here in the summer. Double glazed windows to rear and side. And we also have a utility stroke cloakroom as well on the ground floor. So as you can see, there's a WC wash basin and space and plumbing for a washing machine and a kitchen unit to the wall. So, uh, and there's plenty of room there in the kitchen stroke dining room for the dining table as well. So also on the ground floor, we have a really good sized ground floor bedroom. So, uh, very good size, windows to the front. Property is double glazed throughout and we're also uh, gas central heating as well. So now heading up the stairs, have a look at the first floor. So we've got a landing, doors off to the various rooms. So we're going to head down to the end of the property and start with bedroom one. So uh, a, a good sized double bedroom, window to the front. An opening through to the a really good size dressing area. Plenty of room for hanging your clothes, etc. And then a door through to the ensuite shower room. So a really good uh, size shower cubicle, double shower cubicle with the multifunctional shower panel there. And a towel radiator, a WC, 
and wash basin. So we'll continue down the landing. We've got another bedroom as you can see we've got double bed in here as well so another good size bedroom window this time to the rear next room along we have the bathroom so we've got a towel radiator we've got a p-shaped bath with a rainfall shower head over and a separate hand shower attachment and a sh uh, shower screen centrally mounted taps as well WC wash basin and there's also a built-in cupboard as well and then we have another double bedroom this time window to the front and an alcove there with uh, enough room to tuck away a wardrobe and then we have the fifth bedroom so smallest bedroom still a single bedroom with window to the front. Okay, so that's the property internals. Uh, let's head downstairs and poke our heads out into the garden. So back in the garden room, now heading out the entrance door into the uh, very well presented rear garden. So as you can see, laid to lawn, there's a good size paved patio seating area. An outside tap. And there's uh, plenty of outside storage as well. Uh, I've been advised this one closest to us, uh, the shed or workshop has got electric power and lights. And then we've got this other large storage shed or unit uh, on the end there. They've got a wooden decked seating area, a covered seating area tucked away on the side there. Okay, so that was a brief video tour of this uh, really well presented, semi-detached, deceptively spacious, five bedroom house we have conveniently situated within easy reach of the town centre of Watton in Norfolk. Thank you for watching.